Hey there, and welcome back to Grandia 2. I'm sitting down here, I've got my Mountain Dew ready beside me, and I'm ready to go, because I'm going to be recording uh, five or six episodes in a row here today. And I've also got to remember to cut out random battles. So there's going to be quite a few of them. Um, you're not really missing a whole lot by me cutting them out, though, because basically all that I'm doing is using Burn Flame to take them all out in one hit. These guys up here, however, are Flame Toads, which I believe are new enemies. Um, I think we had like frost toads or something like that back in the Durham caves. So uh, it's kind of the same thing, except they're, uh, they're fire elemented, obviously. So let's just spam some attacks here. I'll probably just use a spell to finish these guys off too. But I can't use like burn flame because they're resistant to that since they're obviously flame toads. So I'll probably just throw a zap on them. Uh, also, as you notice here, I taught, um, I taught her fast dance world. That was the single targeting dance attack. So that's going to be helpful against bosses and stuff. Because, uh, unfortunately, she's gonna kind of be reduced to the role of healer when we're fighting most of the, like, the bosses that have Millennia along with them. Since Millennia is gonna be taking over the attack role, somebody's gotta take over the healing role. So I figured I might as well give her something that she could be useful to attack when we don't need any heals. And there's that for you, in case you forgot what it looks like. It was actually the first spell we saw in the game, wasn't it? Unless, well... I mean, when we fought Millennia way back when, I don't think I ever let any of the gargoyles use Howl on me, so... I don't know, she might have used Burn before that, though. Up here is a Dragonfly Slayer. It actually is less attack than the, um, the weapon that Merrick has right now. However, it is super effective against the, the crab monsters in this area, I think. So, um, if you want to sacrifice the attack power for it, then be my guest, but if you're like me and are being cheap and just using one spell to end everything, then it's probably not worth it. Oh, come on, dude. Thanks to all that dudes hopping around over there, we got surprised in that battle. Yeah, so, uh, what was I saying? I completely forgot. I'm fighting all these random battles. The reason we're trying to find a way off this place is because we're trying to get back to the ship, in case you forgot. But, uh, I don't know how you could forget. That's kind of a, the big major thing at this point. Okay, lots of pointless random battles. What's back here? Scroll of All Heal. That would be nice if I actually needed it, but I don't. Uh, Tio's about out of MP. I should probably recover that, but I don't feel like going into the menu right now. Okay, fine. Let's do it. Items. Where's my Lumir flowers? There they are. There we go. And Tio is still a one man or one woman killing machine. Ah, crap. You know, it gets to a point where, um,. Uh, okay, now, ah, uh, crap. Okay, good. Alright, ah, uh, jeez. Okay, finally, can I say something now? Jeez. So, <laughs> sorry that the whole thing in between battles has basically just been me grunting and making random noises. But as I was saying before, it gets to the point where the random battles just become a little bit repetitive. You know, especially when you can just use a simple spell and take them out. But uh, I think we actually have a mini boss coming up. Uh, should be pretty close to here. Oh, that's going back. The compass misled me. I thought I was just going to turn a corner and be where I needed to be, but uh, I hope that shrimp didn't respawn. They kind of look like a shrimp, don't they? Eh, even if it did, I wouldn't stop by and fight him. Okay, so let's jump and jump again. What is this? A platforming game? Oh, frogs. Alrighty. Oh, more frogs. You know, the only reason I hate the frogs more than the crabs is because the frogs make me waste 20 MP on Zap, whereas the crabs only make me waste like 13 on Burn Flame. Ooh, is that a troglodyte? Uh, if it is, I'm gonna leave this in because we haven't seen those in a while. Maybe a new kind of troglodyte. I don't know. I'm excited. What is it? It's a scaly warrior. That's a pretty awesome name. Uh, okay, we don't know what he's doing yet. 
What is he doing? Regular attack and regular attack. Well, that's new and original, isn't it? I hate how when Teo goes last, it's kind of annoying. Uh, yeah, well, we've got time. I've only been... I only have like five minutes worth of video here. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's why Teo's health was low. I, I gave her the, the life up skill in between episodes, and it doesn't recover your health when you do that, so... I bet Rito's having fun warping around there. Lunacy Egg. Well, that sounds bad. I don't think I want Confusion, so let's cancel that. Right, that one should be dying from the rest of the attacks. And Rito can finish off this frog. See, that's not so bad. So those were the Scaly Warriors. Lunacy Egg, um, I'm guessing it does Confusion. You know, that would make sense, right? Lunacy. And you obviously don't want that, because Confusion sucks. It wears off pretty quickly, though. And obviously, if you guard, then you have a, a lower chance of being inflicted with it. So this place is kind of different from the rest of it. We're walking around in, I guess this is supposed to be like shallow, shallow, shallow water, like this is a reef or something. Uh, I'm gonna have to burn the rest. Ooh, a lullaby staff. That sounds cool. Yeah, I'm gonna have to burn the rest of my Lumiere flowers anyway, so let's do that. Alright, that's all we got. So, uh, no, don't exit out. It's circle one too many times. Sleep effect. Ah, well, might as well, right? Sleep's cool. If there's gonna be, like, a save point or something up here, I'm gonna be mad. I should probably heal Teo sometime soon, too. Okay, this is like going backwards, but I can keep going this way. Oh man. I don't want to fight you guys. You know what? Oh, okay, just screw it. I'm not bothering. Usually I like to get skill coins and magic coins. Okay, that battle actually kind of caught me by surprise. I didn't really see it there. What is this? Electrum Stone. Awesome. More useless stuff we'll never use. Well, looky here. It's a save point. Could have recovered my magic here. Um, yeah, but I think we should be getting up on the mini-boss right here. This may be another video, I don't know. Hopefully I can finish it within the next couple of minutes. Actually, it's gonna give me a chance, so, um, I'm just I'm gonna end the part here, because I don't want to risk, you know, this battle running over and all that stuff. So, anyways, I'll see you guys next time when we'll take on those two giant crab things. See you then.